So Thomas Covington here at MXGP of France in Saint Jean d'Angély. Man, you're good at these qualifying races. Yeah, you know, I, I tend to do pretty well on Saturdays. Um, not sure why, but uh, you know, just hoping I can bring it over into Sunday this weekend and uh, you know get a good start. Um, I think the start's the biggest thing here on this track because it's uh, super one line and you know just one big ride on the inside of a lot of the corners. So uh, the start's just really big. They said a storm will hit um, overnight. How do you prepare for that? Like, are you going to think about that overnight or you'll see tomorrow in the morning and ch change tires and stuff like that? Uh, you know, I, I like a good mud race. Uh, I've had a couple wins in the mud, so um, yeah, I'm not really worried about that. And Usually I'd be worried about my goggles, but uh, I got my guy Kuzo from 100% here this weekend um, prepping the goggles, so no worries there. And um, Yeah, we'll just have to see how the track is in the morning and uh, how they prep it and uh, go decide on the tire choice and all that then and bike prep but um you know the whole rockstar husqvarna team they do a really good job prepping the bike for the mud with uh, jackie martin's being a past champ you know he knows all the little tricks and things to do to get the bike uh, through two muddy motos so um that's one advantage that i have in that situation i've always wondered american riders always train on the same tracks uh, in the u.s i mean like baker's factory and stuff like that you in europe don't do that at all like you train in low mall and you're going to train on hard pack what do you think is the best? Yeah, you know, I think if we had the opportunity to train at a place like, uh, you know, Baker's Factory in Europe, we probably would. But um, it's just that there's not any places that we can do that sort of thing in Belgium and Holland. It's uh, pretty difficult to open new tracks, and a lot of the tracks that are there are being shut down because of, you know, environmental reasons, which is a shame. But, um, you know, I, I ride at Lommel quite a bit. I live right by there, and the shop's pretty much on the property. So uh, I've done a few laps around Lommel, and... But yeah, with the GPs, we ride on so many different types of soil. You know, this weekend we're here on the hard pack, rocky soil, and then next weekend we're in some deep sand in Italy. So um, you really just got to be prepared for anything. Thank you, Thomas, and good luck for tomorrow. Yeah, thanks. Appreciate it.